in defense of the poor image, published in 2009 by German theorist and filmmaker Hedo Steyrl, discusses the bad images that abound on the web, with poor pixels and poor accuracy, but with a resilience, in contrast to high-definition cinema and high-end video production, which symbolize social class, like the status of a flagship shop in the visual sphere or often stored out of sight in museum archives. Bad images achieve diffuse and widespread distribution by compromising quality. This is the case with the highly combustible mashups of Marvel IPs that are widely available on streaming platforms. Poor images are spreading everywhere. As the development of media technology, the sharing and participation nature of the Internet era has led to the rise of the UGC user-generated content model, which allows Internet users to easily access resources and post them on streaming platforms for free. The constant flow of poor quality images generated by free sharing and rapid proliferation resists the power of capital to shape and protect the visual spectacle of high definition. In addition, although they are derived from the thesis films that have emerged throughout the history of cinema, mashup video essays are not as reflective and subjective as thesis films. They are produced for the purpose of personal preference and fan base, and are secondary processed for the purpose of conveying a clear personal point of view. They disregard the structural links between shot composition and narrative rhythm in traditional film language, and instead cluster images with consistent themes and emotions, constantly provoking a sense of common humanity and thus spreading rapidly. Good images such as videos and movies can also easily be edited by audience to these poor images. Everyone can cut and mixes them up to make new poor images, like unlimited reproduction of viruses. As long as there is video, there will be poor image. Besides, people always fill poor image with new ideas. The freedom of edited provide a new platform for creation. The contents are not limited to original movie. People can make their own poor movie. In some cases, poor images have been used to promote the original HD film. For example, in current social media there are many clips of the Marvel films, including narratives, highlights and fan creations. The secondary creations not only contribute to the characterization of the heroes in the original films, but also add more perspectives to the original storylines. At the same time, the results of the secondary promotion are statistically better than those of the original film, and they effectively lengthen the duration of the film's promotion. In conclusion, in the age of social media, the development of poverty images has facilitated the sharing, dissemination, innovation and promotion of original works.